What's up, my pilots? Air Poncho here, and we're back playing Portal 2. Man, it has been a while. Ah, oh, you guys would not believe. What? Did that loading screen say Wheatley? <sighs> Alright. Oh, oh. So that last test was seriously disappointing. Apparently, being civil isn't motivating you, so let's, well, let's try her way, alright? Fatty. Adopted Fatty. Fatty Fatty, no parents. What? What exactly is wrong with being adopted? What's wrong with being adopted? Uh, uh, well, um, lack of parents. For the record, you are adopted and that's terrible. And also, you with me. nothing. But <laughs> some of my best friends <laughs> oh are Oh my gosh. Also, but look at her, you moron. She's not fat. I am not a moron! Okay, Just do the Gladys, test. don't make Just him angry, test. please. Alright, um... Let's get rid of that uh, turret first. Womp. Hee <laughs> hee. See you later, dude. Alright, so it looks like we've got a cube dispenser and a button that turns off the, hmm, the funnel. That's weird. Okay. Let's see if we can get that cube over here. Now, check this out. Actually, it doesn't turn off the funnel. That's what I assumed it did the first time I saw it, but step on it, it changes the direction of the funnel. Now this is a cool puzzle. Alright, so check this out. It'll grab the cube and pull it towards the beginning rather than pushing it away. Oh shit, I should have changed that. Actually, I couldn't have really done much with it, could I? Alright, so let's do... Wait a minute. Shit. Uh, wrong portals. <laughs> wrong portals! Okay, and now... there. Change the direction. And you see that it will go back through that portal and come out wherever it is I decided to move the orange one to. Now all I need to do is grab it before it goes past me. Thank you! Alright, I'm gonna put you here. The door is already open, so we just need to get to it. So I don't see any portable surfaces up here. I think it, pushing this portal off the edge is just to get rid of it. I don't see anything back here. I know I'm not totally privy to all the Easter eggs in this game, but it's a playthrough, not uh, or it's a it's a let's play, not a walkthrough. So no biggie. All right, so now I want to get up there. So I, I want something to push me up there. So I'm going to see if I can suck that cube off of the switch. Am I missing? I am. There we go. Now I can use this to move me up to the door. Not enough. If I'm such a moron, why can't you solve a simple test? What? Alright. Weedly, you really losing me now, man. Yeah, Gladys, if there's one thing that you lack, it's tact. But as I was saying at the beginning of the video, uh, these loading screens are hilarious. Wheatley Laboratories, and it's not even straight, it's like, it's crooked. The letters are just crooked enough that it's like, he can't even put the title on right. Hilarious. I've had a hell of a week, but it's over now. Oh, I, I like classical music. What is it supposed to do? Danger, danger. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. I hope that didn't, hope that didn't disturb you too much then. It was the sound of books. Pages being turned. So that's just what I was doing. Just reading uh, books. Oh. Not a moral. Anyway, just finish the last one. Just now the hardest one. Machiavelli. Do not know what all the fuss was about. Understood it perfectly. Have you read that one? Yeah. Yeah, doubt it. Well, on with the test. Wish there was more books. Well, there's not. Yeah, I heard that the uh, Big Hungry Caterpillar was pretty good wheat. Let's see, so we've got a springy plate test. I love these. And the music that plays. Oh, it's just that sound, it's so cool. <laughs> it's so much fun, it's so techno, new age, it's just, it's just cool. Alright, what am I supposed to be doing? I got a bouncy thing here. I think we already had one of these where I had to catch a cube. This room looks really similar. I guess it just goes to show that Weed is recycling the old rooms that Gladys used. He's reusing Gladys's tests. Now, if I remember correctly, this is a room that you will fall and die in a lot if you are doing things wrong. So let's see. I want. Oh man, I don't even know where I'm. Where I should start here? I need to get over to that switch. I'm sure, but I'm not sure what it's. Oh, it's gonna drop a. It's gonna drop a cube. All right, I can handle that. Let's see. 
Well, hell, let's just try something, shall we? Can I put a... Yes, I can. Alright, let's get over to here. Oh, wait a minute, what if I went... Whoops. No! Oh, shoot! <laughs> That's what should happen. It's just, it should, there should be some sort of dramatic or, or funny thing that happens when you fall off of the edge of a pit like that. It's hilarious. Oh, I get to hear the cutscene again. Yes! Exactly what I wanted. I failed to get even a single checkpoint in here. Sorry. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. I hope that, hope that didn't disturb you too much then. Yes, we leave. Just reading books, you know. You know, literature. Just reading, uh, green eggs and ham. Um. You know, and the like. Why am I up here? Alright, I'm now getting stuck on the ceiling. That's fine with me. Gives me a chance to look around. Okay, we got a button over there. Probably should try to get to that. The question is, how am I going to get up to the button? Once we're there. Hmm. If I could push myself into the other end of this, I could go anywhere I want it. Because while I'm floating along, I can move the other portal to exactly where I want it to be. Hmm. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. No, okay, this is what took me so long to figure out, because I, so, I got so used to using this funnel to move you slowly around the room that I forgot about the fling that you learned way early on in the game. See, so I got an orange one below me. If I put a blue one there, I'll fall down and land right where I want to be. It's perfect. <laughs> oh, that's satisfying. All right, let's go push the button. It's probably a checkpoint. Oh look, it's gonna fall what, over there. Oh, and right off the edge. Mm -hmm. So now I gotta figure out how to get that up here. So it opens the door. I wonder if there's any way to activate the door and then run out. I don't know. I feel like there's probably a way to cheat it, but I'm not sure what it would be. Alright, let's try something a little, a little different than just dropping it into space. Let's see. It goes here. Oh, we know we can do the same thing with the cube that we just did ourselves. It's pretty straightforward. Did I just walk off the edge? Oh my god. <laughs> That's embarrassing. Oh, wow, I literally just, like, face palm. That was, mm. That was shameful. Shameful display. Oh, uh, what am I... Am I gonna have to... No, okay, good. <laughs> that There was a checkpoint in there at some point. Alright, give me another cube. Yeah, I just walked right off the edge of this platform. I'm not even looking like an idiot. Come on, let's see if I can catch you. Oh, oh, nope, sorry, bud. No, I did catch him, and then I dropped him immediately. Good work. That's what oh, I do in real life. What was that? That was nothing! That was nothing! I'm trying, Wheat! Okay? I can't make this relationship work by myself. Which he obviously doesn't. I was in it for the science. Him, though. You were in it for the science. Oh, Gladys. I feel like you were in it for some sort of sick pleasure. The science was... Well, I don't know. She was doing science. And still alive. Whatever. She's still alive and she's in a potato. Oh. Looks like Wheatley's running, running windows. What does it say? Oh, goodness. An operator exception has occurred at uh, 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 neutron multiplication rate at spike value uh, nine 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 days. <laughs> Press any key to vent radiological emission into atmosphere. Consult reactor core manual for instructions. Oh man, bad things are gonna happen. Bad things are gonna happen, man. Number six. Don't mind me. Just moving the old test chamber a little bit closer to me. Um, I thought maybe proximity to the test solving might what? give us stronger results. Oh. What was that? Nothing. Nothing. Oh, sorry. I could have sworn you said something. Ow! Oh, bless your little primate brain. I'm not actually in the room with you. I like technology. It's complicated. Uh, you can't appear at the big old god face. The big god face. Oh. Weird. I keep smashing into this. Do I get an achievement? I bet I do. I don't know. You should get an achievement for doing it like an idiot, like I just did. So I saw a faith plate and was like, hey, I want to go flying through the air. Ooga, ooga, ooga. What fun. Come on, break it. I want something to happen here. Ah, whatever. It's not that exciting. Oh, I'm not actually in the room with you, am I? Oh, wheat. He's a funny guy. What is this? We got some 
Got some turrets. Oh, I remember this room. This one took me a few tries. Let's see. What have we got in store? We need to get up to the door, which has something attached to it. It looks like that button. We need to push that button and then get up to the door. What are we going to put on it? We're going to put a cube on it. How are we going to activate that? There's a thing here. Okay. First step, get a cube. Oh, hello, there's a faceplate there. And an emancipation grill. Hmm, okay. Alright, but we've got one of these little shields to use, so let's use it. Let's try and stop it like this. Come on, it's gonna be the right height. Nope, too high. Let's try right there. Got as many cubes as we want, doesn't matter. Boing. Perfect. Now I have to get it. Tell me I can just grab it. Come on. I can't crouch and just snatch it. Man, yeah, okay. Um, well, if I. Well, I can just portal down there and get it, I suppose. For, for quick, I probably can just run by, by these turrets. I don't know if this is gonna work. Oh, it did. That's a little bit disappointing. Those turrets are not nearly as smart as I thought they'd be. Okay, now we need to stop ourselves from flying too far past this walkway, so let's block it off, just like that. I think we're getting it now. Sproing up here. Very nice. Now I can take this back to the button, but there's no way I'm going to make it through there without getting killed, so... What to say you, we put up a little shield. Very nice. And now... Oh! Uh -huh. Well done. It's blowing, but they can't hit me, so it's no big deal. Now I need to get out are of you, here. Are you absolutely sure you're solving these correctly? I mean, yes, you solved it, but I'm wondering if... Maybe there's a number of ways to solve them, and you're picking all the worst ways. That's probably it, wait. No, no, that was the solution. Ah, what am I missing? You're just kind of an idiot, wait, that's all. You don't understand, man. You're not in it for the science. All the wrong reasons, wheat. I wonder if he'd actually, he probably would actually get really pissed if he heard me calling him wheat instead of wheatly. Little wheatles. Oh, He's like a breakfast cereal or something. Not a threat. Not a threat. Huh. So I did some paper craft the other day. Printed out some uh, little Minecraft printouts and folded up a creeper and a pig. It's fun. Oh no. Well, if he's getting desperate, he'll make a mistake. I'm going to tape you solving these and then watch ten at once. Get a more sort of concentrated burst of science. I can't find the god face. Oh, on a related note, I am going to need you to solve these ten times as fast. Anyway, uh, just give me a wave, would you, before you solve this one, alright? I don't want to spoil the ending for when I watch it later. Huh. Okay. So you're going to stockpile solutions and then watch them all at once. Alright. That's fine with me, Wheat. Whatever you want, I'm okay with it. I'm just a test person. Just the monkey. Alright, let's spring. And we land right there, just like you might expect. Okay. Where do I need to fling to? There's a button on the ceiling. With a thing below it, so I'm betting we need to push a cube with this funnel. Push it to the ceiling. Okay, we've got a cube up there. Can I fling myself up there? There's a window. Can I portal up there? How in the world am I going to get to that? Hmm. Let's, um... Here we go, let's try this. What if I did this? Spring to the blue. Flying up out of the orange. Spring out of the blue and land... No, not nearly far enough. Alright, let's try a little differently. Let's try using the funnel to get the height. Like we did in the previous test. Come on, there we go. Let's not go a little higher here. And then I will put the orange, the blue portal right there. Oh, okay, there's a button. This button lowers the platform for us, alright. Have to make a note of that. Woo! Hello? Alright, he got this cube down. It's the first step, I guess. And then here we can block a laser, alright. Nudge. That turns off the funnel. Why would I want to turn off the funnel? Oh, it's like a plink through here, that's why. How do I get out of here? Thank you. Let's do 
this. Okay, now I'm going to put orange here and blue there. Very nice, alright. Yeah, like I was saying, I made some paper craft. Uh, I folded, I printed out and folded up a creeper and a pig. That was a lot of fun. It's actually surprisingly rewarding. Just uh, an educational venture. Is there anything else back here? I feel like there's something more here, but I can't remember where. Yeah, look at the catwalks out there. Maybe I just got distracted by these the first time around. I don't see any way to... It's not, it's not portal receptive or anything. I am on the lookout for these sorts of things. I don't, I don't, I don't... I show everything I know about. That's, you know, that's sort of my, my motto. Just do it all if you know it. At least, oh, let's try not to get ourselves zapped. I'm gonna portal back up here and then we'll mess with the laser. So where do I, what do I actually want to do here? We got two platforms up there. And we need to... Ah! Okay, okay. Let's try this. Let's put this laser on the switch. So I can actually do it. There we go. Alright, so now we'll get onto this platform. That's the first step. And then... Turn it off. Okay. Halfway there. Now I need... You... To, whoops. You to be there. Okay, I need to just... Uh, let's move the orange portal. Boom! Alright, and the cube's where I want it. Now I want to turn the funnel back on. So we'll do that. Now we'll put the funnel here. And that there! Ha-ha! This takes a lot of stuff. It's basically shooting a long series of portals from this one platform. That lowers this. We switch platforms. Change oh, the thing. Whoops! Oh, oh, sorry, we... To tell me Why are you making this so hard for me? I don't mean to, man. You're my pusher. Or vice versa. Remember when I told you that he was specifically designed to make bad decisions? Because I think he's decided not to maintain any of the crucial functions required to keep this facility from exploding. Oh, that's not good. That's quite bad news, to be honest. Quite bad. Hmm. It's not how they do it in Jolly Old England, is it? No. It's quite good. Got more to say, Gladys? Oh, you always do, don't you? It's about the whole damn whole first help he's talking. Was was self-destructing already fixed. Hmm. Programmed in one last tremor for all time's sake. Two, like one or two more tremors in there just for fun. Morning. Core overheating. I can't keep his job. I'm not a monster. Ignore what he's saying, but just keep on testing. Hmm. Let him keep his job, eh? All right, so we have a moving platform over here, and we have a laser grid that activates and deactivates based on these lasers here. We need to get ourselves over there, so... Let's move the platform first. To where we want it to be. Da -da -da -da. Right there, that's good. Now... Hop over on it. Now the rest of the puzzle I think is solved from right here. So you can see we've got a button there that's going to activate the cube dispensary here. So let's first set up the portal chain here. Put the blue one down, and the orange. Alright, now check this out. Get too close to this, you're going to get burnt by the lasers. So, let's actually... a little bit more. There we go. Now the upper one. Uh huh. Deactivate the laser grid. Very nice. And now, I'm just actually going to go ahead and jump this. Oh, barely made that. Wow. Alright, well, I got a checkpoint for it. So now, we'll continue moving the platform. And it'll eventually make it back over to where we want to drop the cube on it. But yeah, thanks to those of you who are so patient and didn't, didn't pester me about not having any videos out this week. It's just... I can tell you, whenever I miss that many days in a row updating, it's because something very tiresome is occurring in my personal life, so... And there's nothing that uh, posting a comment on my channel is going to change. cube to get zapped by the lasers, so I'm going to stop it right there. And I need to... I need to get over there myself. Oh, shoot, I should have been on the platform doing this. Damn. Alright. Can I make the jump? Oh, that's doubtful. I can't make that. Hmm. 
All right, we're gonna try again. Let's just keep going here. I'm gonna move the uh, platform the rest of the way. The cube will get burnt, whatever. But it'll go back, and then we can do this again with a cube in tow. What say ya? But uh, I have a three-day weekend this weekend, so quite a number of videos should be appearing shortly. I love these uh, three-day weekends, so I've got lots of time to produce. Oh, man, it almost fell off. Jeez. Gotta be careful with those cubes. They're pretty fragile. Got these nice lenses in them and everything. Alright, here we go. Okay. Now, one more time. Move the platform. Oh, oh we're going the wrong direction. What's happening? Huh. Now we're going to move to the far side here. And stop. Take the cube. Oh, wait a minute. Let's turn off the lasers first. Move the cube across the danger zone. Because the goal is to get it to there so we can just portal it back. And then we continue moving. And stop moving. Alright, there we go. Up and down. Am I doing this wrong? Oh, I'm doing this wrong. Shit. <laughs> oh, I'm not even, like, solving the puzzle. I'm just taking the cube to the door. Ah, oh, Jesus. Alright, almost there, guys. Almost there. Just need to move the platform back. You see, that is the receptacle that we want. So we're, we're quite close now. We're just going to need to do that exact same thing uh, again. And then we'll have it. We're that close. Okay, let's look through here. I can't quite make that jump platform a little bit farther. It's far enough. Ow! Jesus, I thought I moved that. Hey! Hey! Get over here! There we go. Take the cube with us this time. That's the whole difference. Okay. Now I just need to get the cube to line up with that. Hell, I didn't even really need to line up. It just needs to... How am I going to get back once I... I guess this may take some fine tuning. That's fine. Handle that. And stop! Thank you. Let's move you over here, buddy. Oops. Wrong one. Stop! That's pretty close. Wow. There we go. Alright, now I want. Can I make that jump? I can make that jump. Alright, so the platform's in the right place now. Let's not move the platform. Now if I do this, where do I... Oh, actually, wait a minute. I need to get across before I do anything dumb here. What I want is the... Oh, I see. Okay, there's an area over here for me to do this with. Okay, that's handy. Now I use the cube. Ah, oh, that's good. All right. Now the question is, can I get back? Okay, I can get back and then set, reset up the lasers. All right, there we go. That was a challenging puzzle. Oh, it's still nothing. Let's keep moving. Sorry about the lift. It's out of service because it melted. Because it melted? That's okay. I'll just take this convenient foam. This looks like fun, actually. Let's do it. Might as well, you know, give you the tour. Um, to your left, you'll see some lights of some kind. Don't know what they do, um, but very sciencey. Very sciencey. I can't run, Wheat. I'm in a funnel. Ah, Wheat. Uh, you're not helpful. Totally. All right. Please, Gladys, be my guest. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time.